Before assembly, the seal must be closely inspected for the following defects. No damage on the circumference of the sealing lip or the inner diameter. If the seal needs a pretensioning element, check that the element has no flash or damage. Never reinstall a used seal or a pretensioning element because there may be defects or geometrical changes you can't see. This will result in a loss of pretension or cause the seal to fail. Beyond the seal itself, the grooves must be carefully examined. The bottom, walls and edges of the grooves must be free of damage, such as burrs and nicks. The surfaces and dimensions of the grooves and the cylinder tube should be finished according to Trelleborg Sealing Solution specifications. See surface specifications in the YAP and groove dimensions in the Hydraulic Seals Linear Catalog or on the Trelleborg Sealing Solutions homepage. Assembly tools must not have any sharp edges and should be routinely inspected to make sure they have no burrs or scratches. The recommended material for installation tools is polyamide or polyoxymethylene. For further information and support, please contact your local Trelleborg Seeding Solutions marketing company. The installation of piston seals on a clean support plate is recommended. Install the pretensioning element into the groove. By moving a finger or a tool 360 degrees around the piston between the element and the groove, you can avoid twisting the O-ring. Place the loading mandrel over the piston so that the edge of the tool ends exactly at the groove flank and all grooves above it are covered. Place the zircon piston seal over the loading mandrel. Position the pusher tool above the seal. With a rapid push, the seal will expand over the loading mandrel and will snap into the groove. It will return to its original shape and be firmly seated. If the mounting force is too high for a manual operation, support with a machine, for example a press or a drilling machine, is recommended. If no assembly tools are available, the following installation method is recommended. Install the pretensioning element into the groove. By moving a finger or a tool 360 degrees around the piston between the element and the groove, you can avoid twisting the O-ring. Place the seal in the groove. Expand the seal by using two fabric belts and guide it until it fits into the groove. It will return to its original shape and be firmly seated. Cover the tips or sharp edges of the screw threads to avoid damaging the seal during the mounting process. The cylinder tube inner diameter must have a lead-in chamfer of 15 to 20 degrees that must be deburred and rounded. Trelleborg Seating Solutions, your partner for seating technology. www.tss.trelleborg.com.